In this lesson we're going to talk about solving differential equations. And first of all we're going to talk about the most basic method, which is integration. You should have seen integration before, so you should know how to do it. But it's the most basic method, so that's where we're going to start. Okay, so to solve this equation here I'm going to integrate. So I'm going to find the integral of 3x squared plus 2x minus 3. And when I integrate that, remember I add 1 to the power. And I divide by the new power. Again here, I add 1 to the power divide by the new power and here I get minus 3x plus c which I can simplify to x cubed plus x squared minus 3x plus c and in this one we're not given a condition like what on this one here so we can of find out what c is so therefore this here is the solution Okay, and if you want to check that that's the right solution, all you have to do is differentiate it. And if you differentiate it, you should get that. If you don't get that, that means the solution's wrong. If you do get that, that means you've done it right. So next we're going to find this one by integrating. I'm going to find the integral of 5x minus 4. So then when I integrate that I get 5x squared over 5 minus 4x plus c. Oops, that's a 2 because I'm dividing by the new power. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so I've got 5 halves. x squared. Now what I do is I put 0 in here because I'm given a condition here. So now we can find out what c is. Okay, so I've got this equal to 0. Now that equals 3. Sorry about that. That equals 3. I'm putting 0 in, so I've got 0 here, I've got minus 4 times 0 plus c, and 5 halves times 0 is 0, and minus 4 times 0 is 0, and I've got c equals 3. So then the solution is Plus three because that's what we found out c was equal to. Okay. This one here, notice that we have to rearrange it a bit before we can integrate. I can rewrite that as x to the minus one half minus x to the minus two. And I want to find the integral of that. When I integrate that, I get x to the one half over one half minus x to the minus one divided by minus one. Plus c. And then simplifying that here, I've got one divided by a half, that's two x to the half, I've got minus 1 divided by minus 1, that's 1, so that's x to the minus 1 plus c. And if you like, we can rewrite that as 2 root x plus 1 over x plus c. But you don't have to, it's still the right solution. Last one here, I want to integrate this. So I want to find the integral of that first. 
In case when I integrate, I get two x three over three minus four x squared over two plus two x plus c, which simplifies to two thirds x cubed minus two x squared plus two x plus c. And because we're given a condition here, we can find out what c is. And what I want to do is I want to put in y is equal to zero. And it says that that comes out to be minus one, so I put that in here. That's zero, that's zero, and that's zero. So all this is zero, so I get c is equal to minus one. So then I can find out what c is for this equation. So then I get two thirds x cubed minus two x squared plus two x minus one. That's my solution. Okay, so that's a look at how we can solve differential equations by using integration. Yes? Yes?